Okay guys, welcome back. Turn Green Go Ham here, and we are in Upper, upper Cathedral. So, uh, real quick, we're going to take a short path over here. There's some items to get, some enemies to kill, and then we'll be heading on to a whole new area uh, off to the other side. We are going to hold off on this boss for a while. Uh, we could always come back here later when we have Blue Elixir, and uh, th these two hunters are a lot easier, but we can still sneak up and do some damage to one of them. Before the other one gets involved, so let's go ahead and take care of them while we're here. We will top off first, though. Almost got him. That dude just, he does nothing but shoot. Nothing but shoot. Good. Bye-bye. Just you and me, bro. What are you gonna do? With your tinnitus. What are you gonna do? You just gonna stand there? He's taunting me with his shield. You see that? I need more stamina. I'm gonna have to put some points in endurance or hurry up and get that room workshop key. Got some people here. Don't want to talk. Bless us with blood. Bless us with blood. Okay. Bless us with blood. Bless us with blood. So just all kinds of creepiness going on around the cathedral. Give me your loot, bloodstone shards. I wish they were twin. Okay, so there's two paths to take here. We're gonna, um, actually, I think there's a crystal lizard. Or, oh, I did look it up. It's scurrying beast. It's not crystal lizard. But I can actually use the proper term, scurrying beast. Get him and then go this way. Ooh, almost forgot about you, big boy. Hurry up, stamina, hurry up. Oh my gosh, no. No, don't take me right now. Don't do it. Okay, good. We are going to get taken by them before too long. Yeah, that's where we were with the doors. I'm gonna drop down here. Plunge that guy. Never understood that. No matter how many times I plunge him, he just uh, doesn't die. If he has that high defense or if the way you fall just makes you miss him so down here there's a uh, another couple of crystal lizards we don't want to uh, aggravate them make them run off but we do want to aggravate this guy I got that I can chunk at him uh, poison knife why not come on I still call them crystal lizards, didn't I? Scurrying beasts. Maybe it's just one. I swear there were two, though. I see one. Nope, there are two. Kill you. Oh, no, come back. Don't run away. Okay. 
Got them both. And then there's some more weird stuff going on in here. We're gonna hang our left and pick up some lead elixir. That is fantastic for NPCs and hunters and things of that nature. Basically, you can just go toe to toe and swing at them. So you don't you don't see anything here. But if you were to say try to approach the door, got another one of those invisible dudes trying to take you. So this and that other area in Cathedral Ward, those are those are two uh, different zones. I mean, if you get grabbed there, they frenzy you. Uh, at this low level, it can just flat out kill you, but then they uh, kidnap you and take you away. So, we are going to head over to Charnel Lane, I believe is what it's called. I'm not big on zone names. I know the maps. Uh, oh. So there's our main boss there, uh, but there is a complete new zone over this direction. And I feel it's important to go this way first. Uh, Hemwick Charnel Lane, maybe that's what it's called. Uh, I feel it's important to go this way first because the area changes uh, once you kill that boss. Um, different enemies, uh, different look. And I actually like this zone. I heard you. I just didn't know where you were. Tons of gun bros in here. You did not get one shot. Look at that. to go this way first <clears throat> there's a few items over here there's going to be a big cluster of these guys the more we can take out in the beginning the oh look at that i was gonna say the more we can take out in the beginning the easier it'll be maybe i should have used a molotov huh. okay quick run back After a long loading screen. Oh, Eileen? Oh, Eileen's here. Let's talk to her. Oh, hello there. Perfect timing. I must warn you not to go near the tomb below Erden Chapel in the Cathedral Ward. Henrik, an old hunter, has gone mad. And he's my mark. Got the sh emote. Don't go near the tomb. I have business. <laughs> yes, ma'am. We're going to go right now. I don't care if you have business. You tell me not to go somewhere, I'm going to do it. Remember, this is where we uh, killed Father Gascoigne. Where is he? Right there. So let's see if we can sneak up on him. Maybe. Possibly. I want to get a backstab. Yeah. Oh, 
Ah, too many tombstones. Let me out. Take some poison. Oh, no. Juke the poison. No. Oh, did I just hurt Eileen? Didn't know you could do that. The air rune. That wasn't necessary of you, but you have my thanks. We made it with our lives. You're not bad at all. You must have killed Gascoigne as well then. He was falling apart, I'm sure it had to be done. But try to keep your hands clean. A hunter should hunt beasts. Leave the hunting of hunters to me. <laughs> Approval. So is it just me or did she seem really out of breath for only swinging her sword like twice? Try to keep your hands clean. Leave the hunt. Anywho, that part of her quest is progressed. We can move on. Run back up through Cathedral Ward and uh, grab our souls in uh, the area before him with Charnel Lane. Souls, blood echoes, whatever. You know, people people talk about this game and, and how the combat grew by leaps and bounds between uh, Dark Souls 2 and this one. Um, but honestly, you look at Dark Souls 3 and it can't even hold a candle to Bloodborne. And that one came out after Bloodborne. So, I think it's more just the particular play style of Bloodborne and how well they did on this one versus... Comparing it to uh, the, the Souls franchise, this game it just plays phenomenally well. I never get tired of this one. I never get tired of uh, the original Dark Souls, and um, you know I've played Demon Souls many times. So to me, those are those are the best. Um, I gotta be honest, I'm one of those guys, I don't really care for uh, Dark Souls 2 all that much. I've played it through a few times, uh, did finish it several times, but just not, uh, just not my cup of tea, really. Oh, you have my souls, or blood echoes. Thank you. Let's see if I can go through a, a little more carefully this time. Still going to go after the same group, but I'm going to throw a Molotov. They do have explosives around them. I thought they did. Maybe that's the other group. Now. Still getting shot at. Bone Marrow Ash. That's uh, what buffs our Quicksilver um, abilities. So fantastic that we're getting that here. I guess no iframes in roll. Best an item back here. I think there's one kind of hidden off back here behind a, a tombstone somewhere.
Yes, yes, you can have some too. If you ever need uh, bullets, or if you ever need uh, uh, the ash, come here. Fantastic. Fantastic farm zone. Especially for the bullets. Twin bloodstone shards. And this is where we're headed. I'm gonna take a peek over here, make sure I didn't miss anything after that uh, other gunman. I don't believe I did, I think I got it all. There is an item out in the middle. I don't know if I picked it up, but I think it's pebbles and it's meant to like draw you into the middle. Yeah, I think I already got it. But if you were to run straight for the, the item right in the middle of the uh, area, uh, you'd have a bad time. Hemwick Charnel Lane, yeah, so I, I got it right. Like I said, I'm bad with areas, uh, good with uh, maps. But, uh, it's an odd place for a lantern. We have 48,000 uh, echoes, so I think we're gonna head back. Been some. I think it's high time we picked up some vitality and got a little health. We have our arcane at 40. Uh, 50 is kind of the soft cap on it. That being said, the once we get tools, the tools will level all the way to 99, and they they actually get really strong even in the latter stages. Ah, I must. What is it? Very let me. But we will eventually want to be 99 there, so we'll we'll be spending the majority of our points now in arcane and vitality. Have a couple of vitality. Let's see if we have any cold blood. Farewell, mate. Yeah. We have enough? Don't know. Probably take Vitality up to 30 and then let the runes do the rest. Mm, maybe 40. Not sure yet. Um, let's go ahead and upgrade. Three more and we will have a plus six Ludwig's Holy Blade. Look at that damage. Approaching 400 now on the fire attack. Fantastic. Yep, nope, here. These guys are what I like to call pushovers. Get a real sword out. See? Oh. Stop that. I'm trying to show something. Maybe it's uh, the other one there. Yeah, there we go. Pushovers. Push 
we head to that item, usually somebody comes down at us. Yep, there she is. Ooh, yeah, fire poke. No fire pokes for me, please. Thank you. Don't like the hot pokes. Run over here. There is something up in this little uh, tower thing here. Talk to this guy. Did you hear the graveyard murmurs? Her woman. Then it's almost time. Oh, I can't wait. I just can't wait. <laughs> No, not creepy at all, right? Then it's all my... Oh, I can't wait. I just can't wait. <laughs> Favorite laugh in the game, hands down. See, this isn't operable. This is actually a uh, uh, shortcut that we'll unlock later. More twin bloodstone shards. We almost have enough to go to uh, plus six now. I think one more actually. Who will be there? Not much going on in this area uh, right now. If we were to kill the boss first, though. There would be some different and interesting enemies here. I'll take it. Fire is most effective around here. I like it. There's a side pass somewhere around here. I think it's up here. Yes. Well, let's take care of this guy first. Uh, excuse me. You're gonna jump all the way over me and then totally ignore like basics of combat logic? This one, and then I believe we also hook a rat right at the top of this path as well. Yeah, we have to because we can't get through the gate. All right, enough with the fire bombs. I'm the fire king around here. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, not not that way. This way. Excuse me. Here before you drop down. Nope. It's just a plunge attack of uh, spot there. I just remembered they were there, so it's easy enough to circle around the corner. Rose. So interesting thing about this. Uh, let's see if there. We'll see if there's a sign on the ground. There's not. I may have to put one. Get this uh, unruly crow out. Take care of the one in the back. You notice this guy just kind of just kind of chills out. Oh, there is a note here. Let's see what it says. Have audience with bird. Yeah, pretty much. So uh, nobody ever kills that bird. It's well known that he is a, a friendly and everybody just leaves him alone so if you come by just you know be friends the 
This is our shortcut that we just uh, saw. No, excuse me. This is a. Uh, this is not the one we just saw. Yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> I was just wanting to hear the laugh again. So, uh, as they, as they say, on your right, if you walk out here, she will push you right off this cliff. More bone marrow. And we got a big boy. Not today, big boy. That's it. Time to head in. We've got some dudes skulking around here hiding. I'm still not 100% sure where they come from, even after all the time I've played this game. I know the, the dog comes from in front of us, but I don't know where she comes from. She always sneaks up on me every single time. I don't know if she drops out of the rafters, maybe? I've never looked up when I walked in. I just always know to turn around. Where's he at? There's a... It's upstairs. There's a wheelchair gunman here somewhere. Yep. Madman's knowledge. And I believe, don't quote me, but I think this is where the bell ringing woman is if you're doing PvP. Or bloodshot eyeballs. Those are uh, chalice dungeon uh, materials, by the way. Yeah, fire. Love how they just have to say it when you kill them with it. Fire, fire. Asking where are you? Is that what he said? Right here, come on. Oh, you first, huh? No, sir. Sit down. No hot pokes either. Thank you very much. think we've seen a lot of dogs uh, we haven't just wait the area down below us uh, sometimes it really really makes me angry I was talking about in a previous video I try not to cuss on here because I know a lot of kids watch these videos um, but man those dogs really piss me off so I guess we'll see get out of there Lots of these guys, too. Oh, good. He saw me. Fantastic. Try, try to pinch me in a tower. Come on, swing. 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 Oh, didn't time it. There we go.
Yeah, there are a few items up here, but there are also quite a few dogs. And I have been run completely out of the zone a time or two by these stupid dogs, so let's see how it goes. Right, there's one. Here I'm running around, where are they? Yep, here they come. If we can get just a couple at a time, that'll be fantastic. Oh! I want to say there's like five or six down there. I know there's more. Where are they? There they are. I have aggroed them all before. That's rude. And over here, we've got a uh, rune. Be careful when you grab it, though. You really, really have to really walk out there. Lake. So all the ones that mention lake, they're all uh, some kind of uh, resistance of some sort. Oh, man, we are uh, past 30 minutes again. Uh, time flies when I'm playing video games. Uh, remember this obelisk? It'll come in handy later. It'll uh, it'll come up later. Yep, got everything over here. Let's grab this item. Open the gate. Now we have a straight path through. And since we're over 30 minutes, we're gonna go ahead and call it here. We're coming up on the uh, the witches, uh, so we're gonna. Uh, take care of them in the next episode and once we do that uh, we're gonna go back and take care of uh, Vicar Amelia I believe her name is Vicar yeah um, so anyway uh, thanks for watching if you enjoyed it leave a like subscribe don't forget to comment down below and we will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching